Hello friends, welcome to the soft learning. Today we will find the number of blades in a distillation process and we will simulate distillation column. So first of all we have to add the component and we will select fluid package and after that we will go to simulation. Before that uh, I will show you the question. This is the question F50 mole percent benzene toluene mixture is separated on a continuous dis distillation column. Requirements of the, the distillation XD is equal to 95 mole percent benzene, XM is equal to 7 mole percent benzene. The following data about the operation of the column are available. Reflex ratio is 3, feed is liquid, At boiling point reflex is the result of total condensation. We have to find these three things. Assuming 100 kmol per hour feed, what are the mass? flows of the distillate and bottoms product how many theoretical plates are required to achieve the separation and c to which plate must the feed be introduced so uh, from the question it is given i have taken basis 100 kmol per hour uh, i have simplified the question uh, the feed is uh, in the feed uh, the composition of benzene is 50 percent the toluene is 50 percent when we multiplied it to the 100 kmol per hour the basis it becomes 50 and also toluene is equal to 50 and the pressure is uh, the pressure of the feed is 1.01325 bar it is the atmospheric pressure on the pressure and the overhead product as uh, the benzene composition and top product uh, and the overhead product is 95 and it is 95 percent when you multiply it uh, to 100 it becomes 95 and the toluene uh, composition is 5 percent when you multiply it by 100 so it is equal to 5 uh, the bottom product benzene is 7 percent when you multiply it uh, by 100 it is equal to 7 and the toluene composition in the bottom product is 93 percent uh, is equal to 93 and the reflex ratio is 3 now I will uh, find the number of plates in the S-band hiasis and will also uh, find the these values these will use uh, D and W that is one is the top product and one is the bottom product the top product uh, mass flow rate and the uh, bottom product mass flow rate of benzene and uh, toluene so uh, first of all i will add the components there are two components in our system uh, one is benzene added and second is ton v okay after that uh, i will select fluid package the most appropriate appropriate fluid package is Henry benson i have made a video on it uh, the selection of the most appropriate property package and as many as is if uh, I will give you the link uh, in the uh, upper section when you have to watch it click on it so I am selecting Ping Rubenson okay we have selected Rubenson and now I am going to simulation click on simulation okay uh, when you have to find the number of trays you will select uh, shortcut this shortcut column okay i have selected it double click on it i will specify and uh, put the feed and condenser duty is qc and o oh, and reboiler duty is qr distillate as top product and this is bottom product okay top product phase top product phase uh, in this distillation uh, problem we have top product phase is vapor so we will change it to vapor okay now uh, we will uh, minimize this and i'm going this to see clearly okay now i am double click on feed we will specify temperature i will i will give it normal temperature 25 degrees centigrade and you can also give it to 
30 degrees centigrade or 35 deg degrees centigrade now i'm giving it to the 30 degrees centigrade and pressure is uh, normal pressure one atmospheric so one atmospheric is 101.3 kilo pascal and the molar flow rate is 100 okay after that uh, i will also write the composition here the benzene is 0 0.5 okay and the feet and talvin is also 0 0.5 okay uh, after that what will i do i will minimize this click on this and we'll go to parameters light key and bottom light key and bottom bottom product uh, what is the light lighter component the lighter component is benzene so the light key and bottom is benzene and heavy key and distillate is Talvin and distillate you can see here overhead product is distillate uh, so the heavy product is Talvin and it is 0 0.05 we will write here 0 0.05 and light cane bottom uh, bottom product light key is benzene is 0 0.07 and the other is 0 0.05 0 0.07 and the at all wean is 0 0.05 and distillate okay the condensing pressure is normal pressure we will write here one atmospheric and uh, the reboiler pressure is also one atmospheric okay we will specify it in next terminal is external reflex ratio is 3 so here uh, it appeared ok uh, now we will go to worksheet and see our simulation as convert you can see here in the uh, molar flow uh, and the, the top product uh, molar flow rate is 48.86 and the bottom product uh, it is 51.14 so it is D and this is W so uh, we can see here the d is 48.86 okay and w is 51.14 kilomole per hour you can see here and the main things uh, we are we, we are finding number of trays so if you have to find the number of trays click on performance and the actual number of trays is 9.434 so you can see here theoretical plates are nine and the feed is entering at fifth plate this is the answer of uh, this question these are the answer of this uh, this question so here you can see the optimal feed stage is five it is uh, written in points but it does not matter uh, you can consider nine and five and you uh, the Espen Hyacinth also gives you temperature, temperature of condenser and reboiler. So this is simulation and you can find uh, uh, theoretical plates and uh, the optimal feed state and minimum number of trays uh, and uh, in very easy method. You can also find it uh, by Lewis uh, Sorrell method or McEwen telemetered but did uh, or manually uh, time consuming and hot processes so you can easily find it in uh, Aspen Hyacis uh, if you have any question relating to this video or my, my previous videos then you can uh, comment here and also like the video and subscribe the channel so you can get more videos about Aspen Hyacis and chemical engineering concepts thank you for watching